when working in any kind of graphics program, you want to always uh, be on the lookout for um, new ways to work more quickly and efficiently. And a couple of uh, great little things uh, that you can do here in Illustrator, and actually it carries across to the other Adobe programs, is um, copying and duplicating things uh, very quickly uh, so that you can create large numbers of them. Um, not uh, to diminish anything that anybody does, it takes a lot of time and effort, but quite often when you see um, uh, a number of small elements or repeating elements, a person doesn't need to sit there and one by one do those individually. Um, and this is a way to um, automate, if you would, um, copying and then making many uh, other copies or duplicating um, as much as you want. Here's how it works. It's really quite simple. And that is that I've got a shape right here and we can duplicate that by pressing the option on PC. That would be Alt. By the way, I've, I've already selected my object and I've got my black arrow and I Option click and drag my mouse and I duplicate the object. Again, I Option or Alt on and oh, notice my arrow is on my object so I Option, click and drag and it duplicates it. <clears throat> and if you want to duplicate uh, something and have it lined up perfectly in a horizontal or vertical or possibly a 45 degree angle you add the shift key. So um, I'll do option, click, hold my mouse. Of course, I'm doing it a little bit slower than I normally would. And then I hit the shift key, option, click, shift, and drag. And you see it will keep the object either horizontal um, uh, or I can option, click, shift, and pull it down 45 or pull it underneath. Either way, it'll snap to that position. And uh, it's as simple as that. Option, click, line it up, add the shift, and you have your object. And then, um, as soon as you've done that, you can use another shortcut, keyboard shortcut, to very quickly duplicate it some more. And um, it's called uh, Command D. Um, or transform again. It's up here in the main menu under transform. Here it is, transform again or command D. And what that means in plain English is you want the computer to um, replicate or duplicate exactly what I just did by hand. So um, I will do Mac command, um, PC control, command D, command D, command D. And you see it's that simple to um, duplicate the object. So, and you have to do it right after you've uh, first duplicated it. Um, and it doesn't have to be perfectly lined up. It can be uh, any, uh, in any angle or in any um, uh, way you want. Option, click and drag, then Command D, Command D, Command D. And um, here's how you can create a really large group of objects very quickly. All right. After I've done that, I'll activate the entire group. And again, Option, Shift, and Drag, create another group, and then Command D, Command D, Command D. And it's that simple um, to simply duplicate it manually and then tell the computer to repeat that function again and again. And uh, that's all there is to it.